so we're back into the fight. Welcome back to Color Splash. Uh, well, a little taste of Koopa Magic. Wait, what? I... Oh, there it is. Koopa Magics, which I believe is... Change everything to... Worn out jumps, really? So I'm almost out of yellow as a result of the magics. enough to actually paint one more shoe. I guess the only yellow is a little bit needed for brown and the sole of the shoe. 300 bonus coins for that. Interesting. I guess it's so you're not annoyed about any items that you just lost. Yeah, no, all of them are still fine. So I don't actually know what this tricolored door is, but I want to open it. Alright, so we're going into yellow, which might be a bad thing since we have no yellow, or it could be a great thing. Oh. Mario will always turn when he reaches a sideways pipe, so we want to get that middle one right now. Alright, so we want to go into this guy, and that should put us straight to the middle. And I'm liking it because he gave us our plunger replica. So I like these doors. I will have to keep that in mind in the future. Get another paint star first. So those doors don't restock until you've gotten paint stars. Which, I mean, probably for the best because I'd grind them way too much in other ones. Oh, and it gave us a little hint about what's coming up. Now then. This one makes more sense than the other one since it seems to not reach height points. I do not like that these guys just get into the following one. Ah. That's just cheap. An unfurl block. That. And I guess it must be the end of the height. Yeah, an unfurl block. That was not painted. So, that means somewhere contains the one I need. There it is. So, we can take this down here and fight whatever happens to be at the middle. Oh, just a regular Koopa. Well, in which case, one of our worn out jumps should be plenty. Well, I guess two would be needed. Because, yeah, he's only going to go into his shell thanks to this. I gotta start planning for that ahead of time. That yeah, it's not enough to kill the Koopa, just enough to, to shell it. So, I can go unfurl it, or I can hop up on top of this pipe, run to here, and, oh, and not quite make it, but it's enough to tell us that you can go up those, at which point you can take the pipe on this side, 
to get both of the uh, stars on this visit, well, at this time, I guess the better phrase it than on this visit. Because, there we go, we got a random power star. And, actually I'm assuming this is going to actually connect us to the red gate, that is. Oh, and we got another token. He's going to connect us to the red gate that is right south of here. Wrong guess. Another token unlocks another temple for us here when we get there. All the purple rescue toads have been found. The little, um... What is it? Notification in the top right telling us that? But, I mean, we're back through here to try to... Hopefully it doesn't need another climbing permit. We've already been seeing that we have one. Have a good climb, Mario. Oh, okay. I thought we had... I thought he had... Alright. So we'll head our way up. I find it kind of bad that they have both of them in the same room at this point. So, up we go. I'm very happy they made the replica cards because I really disliked when it wasn't the situation where um, you are gonna need to both fight with this card and um, use the card for a, a, what is it a puzzle. So you wind up getting stuck with okay, I guess I can't use this card to fight that. And look at that. Because we went and got a paint star, that area actually opened back up. Let's do it again, see if there's a different puzzle for non-yellow. So I'm interested to see what rainbow is. Oh, <laughs> match the spinning blocks and get three to get a fancy prize. Hammer, coin, shoe. Not the best, but I'll take it, I guess. So now we've seen both red and yellow. Not the end of the world. Though it does make me want to come back to see at least blue. Throw block for sure. Lead, lead the line. Badly. Yeah, I gotta hit the unfurl block for sure. Giving me twenty seconds. I do like the trumpet that's being used here. And this one was a lot more uh, time sensitive than the other ones. Into here. Hello, Mountain Sage. Just playing. Regular old toads already.
we've been had. So we gotta give them the gatekeeper a piece of our mind and after we get the pizza. I was trying to hit the ground, but I'll take hitting the enemy. Uh, I'd like to say a regular jump would be enough. Oh, I'll, I'll add a worn out jump just in case. It's worst case, I'll put him in his shell, and then the worn out jump should kill. But I want the strong one first because if I can kill with the jump, I'll kill with the jump. Koopa Paratroopa. I wonder when we're actually going to fill up on uh, cards, because we've been collecting a lot more than we've been using. Okay, your, your head is in the way. Regular jump can kill. Oh, though I don't have that worn out jump I used as my backup. Interesting, so it does use both. Build up, let's go. Yeah, I'm, I'm a little annoyed that the gatekeeper didn't say, yeah, there's no, like, we just cheered you up and you decided to really let us down by not telling us there's a no gatekeeper. Or sorry, no mountain sage. There is a gatekeeper, we talked about it. We get a yellow star. Uh, unfortunately, this isn't the yellow toad we were looking for. Uh, I was hoping so much that it was the yellow toad up here. I was say the yellow one's just going to connect me back here. Which leads me two ways back to the purple team. I'm going to go talk to the gatekeeper, as well as the guy who's selling passes. Wait, why are you missing yellow on the head? Okay, so yeah, your, your head is half Last thing I remember is the park ranger bring me here after finding me straggling on the top. Kids love that cutout. Interesting. So, is he the mountain sage? My mind's a complete blank. Let's just hit him with our hammer, because that's what we do with all of our problems. I remember everything. One of the chosen toads, blah blah blah. Good question, let's find out. Behold the power of the chosen. He's got a key as well, which is what I was hoping for on this map. Oh! Um, terrifying. I have some aggression to work out today.
Turns out I'm just the key for unlocking some random door. Okay, I guess. We got... I'm glad we went back and checked this right away. And the, um, ranger now is the gatekeeper, most likely again. But with that, not only have all three keys been, um, get gathered together at the Crimson Tower, all the purple toads have been gathered together at Ruddy Road. In the next part, we will actually go investigate that. I don't know why I popped into it already, I didn't look at the time. So in the next part, we will go and start at the Purple Toads and see what's happening at the end of Ruddy Road.